everybody, Mike from GetFitOver40.com and I'm in Washington, United States, close to basically uh, Birch Bay area. I'm just on a little four day family vacation, uh, trying to fit workouts in while I'm on vacation because you know I've got my uh, Canadian Nationals coming up and uh, the gym at the place where we're staying, which is the World Mark, just isn't, it's just not up to par. So I sort of did my little research and you'll see behind me, Anytime Fitness. So I just finished my workout there. Uh, I was perfectly willing to come down and pay the drop-in fee for a few workouts while I was here. Um, but they have like a seven-day trial, which I signed up for, and uh, it's pretty good. I mean, it's a 24-hour gym. On the trial, you have to come during uh, basically when there's staff on hand. Just uh, It's fine. It's 10 to 6 or something, which works for me. That's perfectly fine. Um, did my first workout. Can pretty much get everything done I need to. I mean, it's not like the most complete gym in the world, but it's got you know, squat racks, things like that, all the leg machines and you know, all the universals and all of those different types of stuff, and lots of dumbbells up to 100 pounds. So we're good to go. I was, I'm definitely able to get my workouts in. Um, right now I'm just kind of doing damage control. Uh, I am on vacation, so it's a little tough to, uh, to get everything, sorry, I was holding it with one hand, to get everything in. I'm gonna obviously not be eating as good as I'd like to, um, but I'm just, again, it's sort of damage control while I'm out, trying to at least hit maintenance. When I get back, I'll be three weeks out from the Nationals. So for the for that one week, uh, week three out, I'm gonna see what I need to do, if I need to cut hard or not, and then two weeks out is when I really start to cut. By no means am I overweight at this point. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm right on on target. Um, so we'll just see how that goes. I, definitely, I'm, I'm where I need to be right now to put some muscle on and not feel weak or anything, so it's good. Um, in terms of what kind of videos I'm going to be showing you, I'm probably just going to take videos over these next few days, maybe some video of the place where we're staying at, Worldmark, inside if it's not too messy, got some kids staying with us, uh, maybe some pool stuff, maybe down in Birch Bay, some uh, nice ocean shots, things like that. I don't know, we'll see what happens and then I'll probably put it all together on the weekend and publish it for you guys. Alright, again, right now as of today, we're like about three and a half weeks out from the Canadian Nationals, so look forward to uh, some more video clips following this one and uh, again you'll probably see this when you see it now which is probably either on the weekend or after the weekend. Alright here's our world mark uh, place. It's a little dirty messed up because we're living in it. We've got kids and stuff so they tend to leave their stuff around and so do we sometimes. So a little kitchen, it's got the island, right? Got laundry and stuff over there, closet. That's down the hall of the bedrooms, but I'll just show you the other area here. It's got a pull-out Murphy bed. It's Gabriel sleeping there. Living room area. Nicole's reading, I think. All right. TV, fireplace. We're right beside the pool, so you can probably hear it. So it's kind of neat. It's like an indoor outdoor pool. It goes in underneath there and stuff. There's another bigger pool as well. That's just one of the pools. We have a little deck area, the barbecue, All right? There's the beach, the ocean, a little bit of an ocean view. It's enough. It's enough. And there's the pool area. Again, it's a small one. Kind of goes underneath the building. It's kind of cool. Hot tub. But there is another pool, like I said, and there's a gym by that pool, but the gym's not the greatest. So we have a little sitting area here. Go down the hall real quick. This is the world mark of our timeshare so we can stay different places. The girls have their own bedroom here. It's uh, Jordan and her friend Jordan. So they're staying here. And they have a washroom, of course, with a tub and stuff. All right, and shower tub. And then we have a bedroom. All right, that's all you need. A bit of a window, TV unit, All right, and we have a washroom that has a shower, standing tower, a uh, shower around the corner there. And that's pretty much it. So I might show you some video of the pool and stuff, maybe the beach, different things. Just the living room again. It's a great place to stay. The sea shop. One scoop ice cream. Candy shop. Just finished eating here. Yum yum. Well, I didn't have much and coffee though. Espresso, a little shot. Alright, we're at the 
we're at the shop, candy shop. Pretty awesome. Mostly stuff I can't have right now. Okay. Maybe come back. Kids love this place. And ice cream. Candy. Okay. 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 Go ahead. The cord that's hanging down. That one, yeah. <laughs> crabs under the rocks and stuff for the kids to check out. Nice beach. Seagulls. We're just up there, kind of just across from that white building. Amateur Sandcastle competition day. So I think there's like youth and family events going on. Nothing too fancy, just, we're just kind of starting, I guess. As you can see it's pretty more, pretty wet out here. Tomorrow they're gonna have a Oh! <laughs> 